Okay, can you all see me? Can anyone see me? How about let me know because I have no flipping clue. I think I see one. I think it shows one person. So is this showing up on Patreon? That's what I need to know. I need to know if this is being shown on Patreon. Let's see. Hmm. That's what I'm trying to figure out if um, Patreon is seeing this. And I have no flipping clue. I'm trying to learn how to do this. Publish. And I don't know if it's working or not working. Okay, let's see here. Hmm. So I don't know if that's working or not. I hope. Um, is this working on on Patreon? Because I see that I have one person watching. Are you watching this from extended on Patreon? That's what I need to know. Because I left it, you know, unlisted. We was going to see if we could pull a reading. I was hoping to have more people here watching. So maybe I could pick up on some of you. Now I'm trying to get over here and see if I can see this. Hmm. Because whoever's watching is not saying anything. Okay. Yep, that's unlisted. Okay, so it shows that we do have people watching. Um, maybe someone just doesn't want to say anything. It shows I have at least one watching. So we're going to do, um, we're going to pull some cards. Um, hopefully somebody else comes on and sees this because I wanted to try to start doing some um, live streams for my Patreon um, you know truly appreciate you all so much um, let this be for the Patreons for my Patreons extended reads Patreon extended reads. 
accurate messages. What do they need to know? What do they need to know? Extended readings, accurate messages, please. Okay. For my Patreon extended read viewers, please. What do they need to know? Communication. Okay. Someone's going to get some news. Some form of news that someone is moving. Or either maybe you are moving or wanting to move. Or maybe you're buying a home or wanting to buy a home. There's going to be some form of communication information about that um, or someone is moving I feel like it's going to be different for different people um, hmm. okay I feel like that uh, yeah um, <laughs> something's ended someone is leaving someone someone's someone's out someone's gone Someone is moving. They're moving from somewhere. Um, there's been some watching going on, some seeing, um, you know, just paying attention, watching. It's that type of feel. Whether that is you or someone else, something ended. Death card. We got the world. Ending of a cycle, beginning of a new one. So something's ended in someone's life, and it's this has been something big. Tell me of the ending. Tell me, can you tell me of the ending? What has ended? Three of Cups. Third party situation has ended. So someone's ended a third party situation. Can we know more? May we know more? May we know more? Woo, mercy. Okay. Queen of Pentacles. Star. <laughs> okay, some some okay, someone has they're balancing their life. They're taking someone's take their life back. That's what that feels like. Someone is taking their life back. That's what that feels like. I don't know who this is for. Um, they they broke away from something. Oh, my goodness. Okay. For someone else, this is someone from the past who wants to move towards you after something has ended. Mm -mm -mm. Oh, my goodness. Okay. Yes. Okay, let's see. I'm going to start trying to do these more often on Patreon. Uh, maybe I can get a schedule or something set up eventually. May we have the one? May we have the card, please? Thank you. Okay. Okay, this person comes back. If this person comes back, you need to pay attention to the red flags, the signs are cautioning you. I also feel like for whomever this is that's taking their life back, there's something that you need to pay attention to. There's something you're not seeing and it's like the angels is trying to show you something. They're trying to show you something. Okay. And if you're not watching this on, you watch it later, it can still be for you. I mean, you know, it, it, take away what is for you, leave the rest because they're timeless too as well. And we have the one for, yes, thank you. There's two. To the sea and the tribe. So, okay. You know, right now, the, this Pisces moon, you know, emotions and dealing, dealing with, you know, that, um, all those emotions inside, all of those, you may be dealing with all of that pain, all of that hurt, all of that past um, where you've you've been hurt. You see, that C feels like a lot of emotion. Sometimes it has to come out in order to go forward. 
sometimes, you know, we can be involved in something and have to really go through a lot of emotion and hurt and pain to see that something is not good for us. This is actually very beautiful, though, because it, it's like, uh, you see how she's alone? Whoops. She is alone. Someone is growing because they're not really alone. Look in the sky. There's a faith. I hope you can see that. The angels are always there. They're alone. The tribe. You know, this is a, this is about having your soul tribe or finding them. You know, um, and it's also, you know, I see here giraffes. This is about seeing. This is about opening one's eyes to see the whole picture. Where we might have been blinded in the past about being in a third party situation or being in um, something that did not serve us, seeing clearly now, seeing everything. That's what I'm getting with that, you know, and um, that's beautiful because, you know, it, you look at this death card and you think, oh my goodness. You know, something's changing, something's ending in my life. Uh, but you got to remember, sometimes when someone rejects us or they put us in this position of a third party or whatever, and we have to break ourselves free from that, though it may hurt, sometimes that rejection and that going through that is God's protection. Um, because, it, you know, it's like whoever I'm talking to, I feel like with, us having the, the queen of pentacles here. Somebody's working on themselves. They're working on their stability. They're working on something. They're working on their, you know, spirituality or their life or their, their home or their family or their pentacles. But there's growth. And, and look, there's peace. It's like finding that peace. I also feel like that animals are mean a lot to someone. For someone, this is um, and not what you would think average, you know, most people would think dogs or cats. For someone, this is more, this is some different, different types of animals or um, maybe even Something, an, an animal that someone might would, uh, you know, fret over or, yeah. But this is, you know, this is healing. Healing and balance, bringing it back to your life and healing from it. That's what I'm getting with that. Because with death, there's a new beginning. That's beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Okay, yes. Let's see. I'm sure we may need one of these. Now, this is affirmation, so get ready. Patreon, please. Patreon extended. May I have the card, please, Spirit? Please, Spirit. What? What? Oof. I have to check. Okay, it's all of them. <laughs> That's a lot. Get ready. Are you ready to speak it? Please say it after me. We say it in threes. First one. Perseverance. Ready? I know that I can do whatever I set my mind to. I know that I can do whatever I set my mind to. I know that I can do whatever I set my mind to, and so it is. Beautiful. Regret. We have regret. Say it after me, please. I know that I cannot change the past. I know that I cannot change the past. 
I know that I cannot change the past, and so it is. Then we have honesty. Beautiful. Repeat after me, please. I can't always expect the truth from others, but I can expect it from myself. I can't always expect the truth from others, but I can always expect it from myself. I can't always expect the truth from others, but I can expect it from myself. And so it is. Then we have relationships. Ready? Speak it after me. I am attracted to those people who serve my higher good. I am attracted to those people who serve my higher good. I am attracted to those people who serve my higher good. And so it is. The tribe. Your soul tribe. Your people. And then we have failure. Speak it after me, please. I understand that a mistake is only an opportunity to learn. I understand that a mistake is only an opportunity to learn. I understand that a mistake is only an opportunity to learn. And so it is. Beautiful. One more. Last one is beautiful. Love. Ready? Speak it after me. I commit to the practice of seeing the good in all things. I commit to the practice of seeing the good in all things. I commit to the practice of seeing the good in all things. And so it is. Awesome. That's love. See, that's beautiful. Um, I know we don't have but one person watching. I wish they would say something to me. Um, but I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to pull some more cards because, you know, I'm going to start doing this more frequently. And, I, you know, I want people to, I'm probably going to end up honestly sharing this one uh, with everyone on YouTube. Um, because I would love for our, I would love for our Patreon to grow. Um, I really would. And I'd love for everyone to, you know, get more. Um, but I understand that not everyone can join the Patreon, and that is perfectly fine. Uh, I also do the live streams on YouTube, and uh, I love doing them. So, let's see. Hmm. Hi. Yes, see, we're going to take one of these for Patreon, please, for Patreon, please, for Patreon, please. No, too many. Wasn't filling all those for Patreon, please, one, please, there it is. I felt there was, oh, well, there's two. I will take the two. I will take the two. Okay. We have Sun Goddess. Oh, we have two. Yay. If you would like to, if you can, say something. Say something to me. Um, we have Sun Goddess. And it says, I celebrate each sunrise and recognize the healing energies of the sun. Absolutely beautiful. So this tells me that the sun is going to is very beneficial to someone. Uh, you may honestly gain strength from the sun, whomever I'm talking to. Um, it may also be healing. It, and you may gain um, knowledge uh, from the divine, from the angels, from God. Um, spiritual knowledge. That's what I'm feeling. Absolutely beautiful. And then we have here forest 
Frolic Maiden. I acknowledge my inner child and open my heart to the joy she brings. Absolutely beautiful. So, you know, this to me takes me back to the nature, um, you know, being in nature and, you know, how I was drawn to the goat, um, you know, animals out in nature. This tells me that someone may benefit from being in nature, from um, having, you know, that that sun shine, that um frolicking through the forest, frol frolicking through um, the woods. Um, oh my goodness, yes. Someone uh, gets healing there. Someone is very close to animals. It's beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Okay, let's see. Spiritual path. Patreon, please. For Patreon viewers, please. For Patreon viewers, please. What do they need to know? What do they need to know? May I have one? May I have one? Thank you. Okay, we got the one. It is the one. Hmm. Okay, we got the ever unfolding rose um, cracked open. It's happening for you, not to you. I feel like that someone may feel like um, it's almost like they're just being opened up. It's just, it's a sadness. Is um, it's as if setting and wondering why things are happening to you for whoever this is for, but there is there is a reason for things, and I can't tell you that reason. They're not giving me that, but you know. It's happening for a reason that is something that you need to ask. You need to ask the angels. You need to, um, I feel like there's a lot of healing needs to be done. And, you know, if you'll notice, she's in the water. And I feel like that um, her being in the water, that takes me back to needing to release, needing to um, cleanse, needing to, and I don't mean Take a bath. I'm talking about letting go of negativity, letting go of that past, letting go of the pain. Um, and, you know, many times we can think we let go of it and not, you know, and I'm still feeling this moon energy. So someone may need to do more releasing with this moon. But this is, it's a beautiful card. It's just, I'm feeling a sadness with it. And that's what I'm feeling with it, you know. The card can have different feeling, but that's what I'm getting with it. Um, hmm. No. Hmm. One of these. For Patreon, for Patreon, for Patreon. May I please have the card? May I have the one? May I please? May I please? Spirit. For Patreon. Patreon. For Patreon. There we go. Okay. It's like, um, <laughs> oh my goodness. We got the dice. It's kind of like, someone feels like their life is like rolling the dice. But, you know, I'm, I'm seeing this as once whatever healing's got to be done, them dice, that luck's going to change. Because, you know, we've got, someone's getting through cycles and they're getting, they're going forward basically is what this is. But 
there's a feeling with that card that whomever I'm talking to, and it could be different people, but I feel like that this is kind of like going back to what I'm feeling with this card. And it's like, you know, a feeling like things happening too. And, you know, the dice not falling in one's favor as the luck thing. That's what I'm getting with that. And it truthfully is. I'm going to take a moon card since we're just, we're still, you know, we're still close to that moon. And I feel like that is really, okay, it's still there. It's, it's like the, the energy. Okay, we actually got two. We got your hard work is paying off, new moon in Capricorn. So all this work that someone is doing on themselves or, or once they start doing this on themselves, it's going to pay off. Hold your vision. Fixed moon. So if you have a vision and you've been working hard and you've been putting in that effort, you've been putting in that work, keep it. Keep that vision. You know, it's going to pay off. It just, it takes time. And it, it you know, we have to put in the work. And we may think, well, we're putting in. And there may be something else that we have to do. Um, just saying, I mean, that, that's, yeah, <laughs> let's see, hmm, I wish somebody could communicate with me, but I don't, I don't know, um, I just, I don't know if, I, I know I see that two people's watching, but I don't see any writing, Last huh, Last chat. yeah, I, I can see that two people's on there, but they're not saying anything, so, I'm not sure, you know. Okay, that's my, my daughter, by the way. Um, I'm trying to think what other cards. I think we're going to pull another angel. Patreon. Okay. Patreon. There it is. Okay. Archangel Raphael. So, you know, Archangel Raphael is helping someone. And um, you can ask. You can ask Archangel Raphael to help you. Because the card says, I am helping you heal physical challenges in yourself and others. You are a healer like me. That's beautiful. It's beautiful. That is absolutely gorgeous. Don't you open that up, ma'am. No, ma'am. I have got a, me a can of coffee and my child is trying to sneak it. Eh, eh. You have to wait. You got to wait. Okay. <laughs> Okay. May we please have one for Patreon? For Patreon, please. Uh, feels like there is one for Patreon. For Patreon, please. Whoop, there it went. Okay. There's two. Okay. We got um, Hil Hilarion Divine Healing. So someone's getting divine healing. Honor your sensitivity. Retreat to recharge and heal. Your light can support others. We have to rest. I know. I had to get some extra rest myself. The divine director. Intervention, uh, intervention and purpose. Divine intervention is occurring. Know that you are being guided. Happiness is your purpose. That's beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Hmm. Patreon. There it is. Peacekeeper. Let go of the need to be right. 
and, and I want to tell you, um, if you're having that, you know, you can always say, if you want to repeat after me, I let go of the need to be right. I let go of the need to be right. I let go of the need to be right. And so it is. You can make into an affirmation, you know, and three is very powerful. Um, the divine hears you, you know, and yes, it just, yeah. Oh my goodness. Okay. We're going to take one of these. I, th I seen three on there for like a second and then it went back to two. Um, I have more people. Okay. May I have the one for Patreon viewers? The Patreon viewers. Whoop! <laughs> they just throwed them. They just throwed them. There's two of them. Yeah. The sacrifice. The sacrifice. Does someone feel like they are having to sacrifice something? Um, just to have something else. Luminous warrior. You know, it feels like someone's having to be brave whenever they may feel like they can't. Um, you know, I feel like this is about, honestly, having to pull yourself together and pull yourself up from the, the depths after being taken to the depths because of something. Um And I'm seeing what she's holding in, on her hand as a butterfly. And for me, that, that, that is um, a feeling of transformation, of, of going from something to more. And I also feels like, feel like that is in knowing and knowledge. And um, that someone, um, the moon is very powerful for you. And this moon may be even more. So, because it may bring emotions to the surface where they need to be looked at, dealt with, um, be that warrior and see, you see how we've got the moon here. I feel like you see through the illumination, see clearly. Um, yeah. Because if you look, you see the dark moons. It's like they're, I'm seeing this almost as if it is the moon card. It's like, I don't trust. It's not being able to trust, not, yeah. It's like someone, though, it feels like is going to be really seeing things. So that's what I have for you. I hope that you enjoyed. I thank you so much for your support, me and my children do, and um, helping the channel to grow so I can get messages out to wherever they need to go that, you know, they need to be seen. Um, so I truly appreciate every, each and every one of you. And thank you so much. Much love to you. Until next time. Bye.